Hello people, well I was able to make it work so I'm talking about new audio EVGA 7.1 Pro uh, what is the problem? well the problem is that to obtain this view and do anything with this card so Pro version as for me it was a bit difficult because we have EVGA site for downloading the software EVGA new audio software so well I downloaded it and <clears throat> this is not the right software as it turns out why well I was going through um, EVGA um, forums and I found that they are talking about totally different um, totally different uh, driver so the newest driver was like uh, one point something okay so well how to get this one point something because I was all the time downloading the version of new audio 0207 for Windows 10 and there is a driver EVGA new audio pro 1.0.2 and the funny thing is that uh, if you get anywhere here you don't have any any links to this driver if you're on the main page for software downloading you have only this driver and nothing here tells us where to find that driver well I got the message finally from EVGA support that I have to go to EVGA support download and here if you go all, uh, audio cards all audio driver EVGA audio pro and I was asking about previous drivers but they gave me this thing they even saw my video and they they've been looking at it uh, at this driver 2.0.7 all the time and they didn't get it that I'm trying to install the wrong driver so when I've installed this driver then I had the firmware update the card uh, turned off the firmware uh, updated and now I have totally different situation and now it works and it's okay but let me tell you as for that big company for that kind of product for which is very let's say expensive product for a gamer this is not the right thing to do somewhere here it should be said that you have to download driver for pro version or something like this if if it's not mentioned everybody is just downloading the standard version of of this stuff because the you are thinking that you are downloading the correct driver okay so that's the thing I wanted to tell you for all those people who are struggling with with the same problem that disconnect and connect the device and all the stuff no you just you just have probably the wrong driver and uh, yeah that is all for this uh, funny thing so now I can turn it on and I can check because I don't have front speakers uh, connected because they are on change so from the lower card but I can test central my subwoofer and rear how funny is that so uh, oh yeah yeah well <clears throat> EVGA as for you there's an information that EVGA new audio and there should be EVGA new audio 
pro software then we would have clear situation you bought pro version you need pro uh, software and this pro software is as it occurs not only for the surround card but it's for the card it has to get it uh, firmware updated so <clears throat> yeah thanks for this uh, um, hours of yeah despair <clears throat> that's all what i would like to tell you so uh, cheers that's the option that works for me hopefully for those who had problems with uh, new audio pro 7.1 this is the exact answer to your problems thank you have a nice day